look at you, you make me blind. Why do you have to be so beautiful all the time? I know I can't be with you. It's killing me to see you with someone else. What to do? Now I'm in the corner and watching you smile, watching you smile. And I can't get over you. I'm losing my mind. All of the things that I wish I could tell. If you're new, my name is Mandy, and ta-da! <laughs> I'm in a new house. Um, so yesterday, Clayton took the day off work, and we moved everything. Bell's at the door; she wants in. <laughs> um, I'll let her in in a second. So, what is the day today? It's Wednesday. <laughs> it is Wednesday, and I'm not really feeling overwhelmed, although I'm surrounded by boxes and coffee tables that need the glass put back in them. I need to steam clean the couch and the kitchen chairs. They are dirty. I think they were dirty before moving. They needed cleaned and now they're really dirty. Um, I still have a few things at the old house that I need to go get today. I also need to clean it really good before, um, you know, we hand it over to the new buyers. So I'm not worrying about any of this really today. Um, I do want to have a little bit of clear counters so that I can 
you know, make dinner here tonight. The first night we got some Mexican food and last night I got pizzas on my way home from feeding the lamb. So tonight we're gonna cook. I need to go to the store because all I have is Italian sausage. And yeah, uh, there, I'm sure there will be later videos of organization. Um, I need to figure out what I'm gonna do with my pantry. I will show you what I've put where so far. And I just thought we'd hang out a little bit this morning. Um, it's six o'clock right now. I think we're gonna be leaving here around eight. Um, someone's supposed to come and hook up the internet today between eight and 11, but I have a lot of stuff to do today. So I'm gonna have to run back whenever they um, come to do that, which is unfortunate, but I wanna get that house clean before it gets too hot. And I want to be able to come home and put some stuff away, find my toothpaste <laughs> and my hairbrush. Um, I did start a load of laundry. <sighs> I have no idea what's going to go where, but I'm excited to get to just slowly, um, I don't know, make it what I want it to be. I don't think we're keeping these stools. They're way too big for this counter. We may end up getting some smaller ones, but um, these are just overkill. So I don't think we're gonna keep these. I may turn my dining room table. It seems kind of cramped right there. Um, I think we're gonna turn the couch. It's just, it's all just sitting here. Like nothing is the way I'm gonna keep it yet. I'm just. I'm gonna try to shove things in places and then later you and I will come back and we will try to organize it the best we can. So uh, if you're new, um, uh, my husband and I just sold our house. We live in Arizona with our um, 15 year old daughter. I have three children, um, two have already moved out. They live here in the same town as we do, but they're not living here. So we're a family of three and Belle. We have Belle. <laughs> so you guys saw I brought all my plants from the other house. Well, anything that was mobile. And we sat out in the backyard last night and you can sit outside the door and look over the wall to just big open desert. And it's, it's really peaceful. It's really quiet. We're, we were both kind of just at peace last night. And then we ate some delicious pizza and everybody took a shower. I actually took a bath um, in Caitlin's bathtub because my bathroom doesn't have a bathtub, but um, yeah, it was just really nice. So, oh, I'm so worn out. My body hurts so bad. My shoulders from lifting stuff, <laughs> but um, no more lifting, just, Putting things away. All right, so um, hang out with me for a little while this morning while we get kind of this kitchen under control. And then, um, yeah, there'll be more videos to come. So thanks for hanging out with me. because as you can see, hopefully you can see, there's no fridge. <laughs> we have to buy a fridge. So we have our extra fridge out in the garage. So we're not going to go out there. Get down. Down. <laughs> I, we have to go out there and get everything every time we want something from the fridge. But we will get a fridge soon. Last little bit of coffee. Another reason I have to go to the store today. I quit drinking hot coffee. I don't like the taste of it anymore. So... It's just iced coffee and uh, yeah, this is water that the realty place left in the pantry. So I need to go put that in the fridge. Yeah, and then we're gonna start cleaning. Say something like you love me and make my day like you always do, like you always do.
tell you how I feel Every day something new If I spend it with you With you With you I don't remember what she did during the day <laughs> at the old house. She was outside a lot. Get in your bed. She was outside a lot because, you know, we had the grass and she just liked it back there. I mean, she's got plenty of room here, but there's no grass or anything. I feel like she's just anxious and she doesn't know what to do because it's a new place. And I feel bad for her, but she's following me around like on my heels everywhere and she's not staying in her bed. I may put her back outside, but our neighbors right next to us have some dogs, and every time I open the door, they start barking. <laughs> they don't wanna wake up Caitlin. Uh, I'm gonna have to get her a bone or something at the store today so she'll sit there and chew it and not bug me like a toddler while I'm trying to get stuff done. Get in your bed. Lay down. Lay down. Good girl. All right, so um, I'm just gonna show you like where I put stuff yesterday. Uh, maybe you guys can leave me some ideas of where to put stuff because I'm kind of at a loss. Like I'm walking around with the same thing in my hand, just not knowing what to do with it. So let's go back over the kitchen real quick and uh, tell you what I'm thinking and not today, but another day we'll be hopefully organizing it all. Stay there. So in this island, I have tons of storage. I'm absolutely in love with this. <laughs> when I have my own house, I really would like an island like this, possibly with a sink in it or something, but I really do like this. It's got huge drawers. I just threw those bags in there. I'm not really sure where I'm gonna put them yet. Um, I couldn't fit the box for these gallon size bags, but I think if I buy a smaller box, I'll be able to fit it in here better. Or I could find like some kind of a storage container that's shallow enough to fit in here. I don't know. I'm not really into like all the, the like aesthetically pleasing stuff. I just like it to work for me, but I don't want these rolling around in here loose. Um, and I'll have sandwich bags and stuff too, but it's all in boxes. You guys, the garage is full of boxes too. So I've got my work cut out for me, but I don't want anything really like on my counters. These are really pretty granite counters. And like I have my coffee pot over there. Let me zoom in a little. Um, I set that up yesterday. I really like that over there. I think it looks really nice. And then I still have like space around my sink. And um, I'll probably leave the utensils there. I'll put the knife block on the counter. This is going to go um, away. And then I got to put all that stuff away. But anyway. I got my air fryer in there and my mixer, and then there's a little um, shelf back there. So I gotta find something shorter to fit back there. I might put that kettle down there because I don't use that. I'll pull it out in the winter and keep it by the coffee pot, but right now I don't use it at all. So that's what's going on in there. I was hoping to fit the um, instant pot in here too, but it's not looking like I'm going to be able to. Which is okay. There's other storage. Oh. And then this one has these amazing drawers. I bet my Instant Pot will fit right there. But look at those. And they're like nice and sturdy drawers. So I've got my crock pot there. And then, I don't know what this is. Some kind of glue. And then I've got, I'm going to put pots and pans here. I already used my skillets this morning to make Clayton some breakfast, which was fun, but, um, oh, I love those drawers. They're awesome. All right, and then I'm thinking above the dishwasher dishes. 
I just threw what I brought here. I didn't bring any cups or anything. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me. But I'm thinking cups on this side, dishes, you know, plates, bowls on that side. And then over here, I'm thinking silverware. It would be, um, I don't know. Ugh. Yeah, it's plenty big for silverware. These are really deep drawers, but I'm thinking silverware in this top one. I have no idea. I have no idea about these big drawers. Seems like I could like pile stuff in, in there and it'd be a mess in no time. But these are both really big drawers. Maybe I'll find, um, I don't know. You know how some people have like baking, um, like a drawer for baking? I don't know if my stuff will fit in there though. I almost wonder if those glass jars that I usually have on my counters might fit in those. But anyway, dishwasher, um, lots of under the sink storage, but I just keep like cleaners and stuff down there. I do want to get a container to put everything in. I don't want anything messing up this, um, the new cabinets. So I do need to get some kind of containers. Oh, I didn't even, I haven't looked in this one yet. Oh, maybe this will be like baking. I don't know, you guys. Here's a little drawer to collect a bunch of junk. <laughs> and then this corner, I hate this. Uh, I used to have one of these in my, our first house that we, uh, rented from my in-laws and I don't hate it, but I don't like these like lazy Susan type things. And I have no idea what to put on here. It's not really sturdy enough. It doesn't feel like to me for cans, like canned food. So I'm thinking like baking stuff, like all my pie pans and stuff. I don't know. I got my muffin tins in there right now, but that is that. And then over here, this one has a little drawer too. And you know what? I have a lot of corning wear and stuff. Sorry about the trash. That um, would be perfect for these drawers. But I just have some... Hey, can you get out of there? I just have some baking... Get down! I just have some baking dishes in there right now. And then up here I put some baking stuff that I just don't use very often. That might be good in a drawer. Like cake mixes and stuff. Um, this one, I just threw stuff in there again. And then I have a little tiny space above the microwave. In the old house, that's where I keep my baking mixes, but I don't know. And then this little tiny skinny cupboard. Now this won't work for me. won't work for seasonings because we have a ton of seasonings we use a lot of them so um I don't know you guys honestly like tell me what you think Ugh, and then this look at that I it's a good place for stuff to get lost again I just threw stuff in there there is a lot of storage space in this space but like what Really? I could barely reach that back there. I could fit a whole lot more here, but there is stuff that I don't use very often, like that, um, the springform pans and my bunt pan. It could go back there, but I don't know. I'm just not sure. And then, gosh, the, I feel like each of these opens on the opposite side. Maybe not. I'm just dumb. <laughs> And then I'm thinking seasonings in this cabinet. I don't know though, because I have my big seasonings. I don't know if they'll fit in there. Yeah, maybe they will. Anyway, that's what I have going on in here for organization, for cabinets, sorry. And then the pantry. I'm just throwing stuff in here. I don't, I don't know yet. I just don't know. I'm not, I don't have a space to like stock up on things at the moment. So I'm kind of thinking I might just, um, let me zoom in. I might just buy uh, what I need like, you know, monthly and then 
I might have to quit stocking up on things until I figure out where I can store it. I do have this linen closet over here and it has a lot of room as well. But um, I don't know. I also have a lot of room in my uh, master closet for extra stuff. So I don't know yet. I'm just not sure. Okay, let's, I'm going to get this stuff put away. I don't even think I have anything to wipe the counters with. But um, 6.30, I might just clean this off and then try emptying one of these boxes. I do need some boxes. Actually, I think I'm going to try emptying these baskets because these seem to just work better. <laughs> They're not as flimsy as the boxes. These boxes, they every time we grab a handle, they would rip. But anyway... It's 6.30. Let's see what I can get done in an hour. Oh, I'd also like to clear off this table. So let's just see. I hear the song you sing As you wake up my soul today I feel the hope when your sun shines on my face Oh, I'll wake up with your grace While the moonlight still fading away I see your mercy coming with the day Oh, yeah My prayer is simple, God Love, have your way voice and you know my every need oh you've seen my hopes and dreams but you have in store far better things my future comes alive when you're leading me Shame me in your mighty 
All right, I think that's it for this morning. It is about 7.20, almost. <laughs> um, I cleared off the table. I have a few things here that need to go somewhere else. Um, we've tried these Libby's green beans a couple times and they're terrible. So I'm going to put those in my car and probably donate them. I might just throw them away, you guys. It's two cans. I have some molasses out because I need to take it to the lamb. We're going to mix it into his food a little bit. I have some barbecue stuff out that I don't know where I'm going to put it. Um, I cleared the table except for my laptop and my glasses and Caitlin's wallet. Uh, but everything else I'm happy with. When I come home today, um, I should have all my cleaning stuff and I can wipe down the counters. I need to vacuum. There's crumbs and stuff laying around. I left out bacon and eggs in case Caitlin wants some. Honestly, I think I'm going to eat a piece of pizza and uh, just get ready to go. I think we're going to stop on the way to the house and get a uh, coffee maybe with a couple extra shots in it. Oh my gosh, I'm so tired. And um, I'm so happy to be getting that done. You guys know, if you've been watching, I've been struggling with the uh, with energy and just with constantly having something like hanging over my head. And I can just get to life here. I'm excited to cook with you in this kitchen and to bake with you. And um, I'm excited to put this house together and just be able to relax a little bit. I'm excited to get a fridge. And um, yeah, I just, I'm, I'm, I'm happy, I'm happy. I was, I was a little, little worried I was gonna be unhappy. I was gonna regret our decision, but I don't, I don't regret it. I do not regret it. I am, leaving the old behind. I'm taking in the new. We were sitting outside last night talking about the things that we wanted to do, not immediately, but maybe in the future. Um, yeah, so I think that's going to be it for this video. Uh, subscribe if you haven't, if you want to see more videos of what we're what we're doing here. <laughs> so there's going to be more unpacking, I'm sure, and organizing, like I said. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching my video. I really appreciate it. I am, I am truly humbled that anybody would watch me do anything on the internet, honestly. So um, give me a thumbs up if you don't mind, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.